Hey everybody, this is Ryan with Long Tucky Supply and I am here to show you guys uh, the new Kiwi uh, conversion kits for the hybrid fanny pack. Um, some of you guys have asked about how to get uh, Kydex magazine inserts in the back of the hybrid fanny um, and we figured out a way to do that. So, um, only disclaimer with the Kiwis is they, um, they do add a little bit of bulk just to the fact that they're already flexed out um, over the traditional magazine inserts. So I've got the 308 um, Kiwis, two of them in the hybrid fanny pack right now, and you can see it adds a couple inches to the back. So if you're gonna primarily run it uh, just with the Kiwis, um, you'll be doing just fine. Um, but in terms of a fair comparison, um, there's the standard Long Tucky magazine inserts um, without any magazines in it versus the Kiwis. Um, so you can definitely see there's a little bit more bulk, but um, it's a lot easier to re-index and actually pull magazines out. So um, definitely worth the benefit. So moving into this, um, we've got, like I said, we haven't got the 308 ones here and I'm going to put in two um, Magpul 10 round AICS magazines right there. I just want to make sure you guys can see it on the camera. Um, so they fit super great, uh, especially with the new size of the fanny pack. Um, and then pulling them out and re-indexing is super easy. Um, so these are the 10 round Magpuls AICS. They work really well. Um, the next one up is the MDT 10 round AICS. Um, this also fits in really well. Um, definitely a little bit lower than the Magpul due to the double stack nature of it, but um, that's okay. The next one in terms of, uh, I guess in terms of height is the five round Magpul AICS magazine. Um, so that one fits in. It's, it does lock into place, but actually grabbing the magazine is gonna be difficult because you kind of completely lose it in there. Uh, so while it is retained, it's gonna be hard to pull out. Um, so I'd recommend some type of Magpul um, on the bottom of the five round Magpul if you're gonna run it like that. And I'll show you what I mean by that here in a second when we get to um, the MDT five round AICS magazines. Um, so I run these without binder plates just uh, when I load stuff long. Uh, but you can see, these are really hard to get out. Again, it is um, it is seated in there. Um, it does have good retention now, but it's almost impossible to get out. So if you are gonna use a MDT five round, um, I just did a little uh, duct tape mag pull in here and it works quite well as a little tab um, to pull the magazine out. So um, just a little primer on like what magazines work, uh, what's gonna have a little more difficulty in here. And then the final one, uh, <laughs> If you're running a gas gun, uh, this is a 20 round 308 mag, uh, a PMAG 20 uh, for a 308, and that also fits in here. Um, I would adjust the tension a little bit, it's a little tight, um, considering this is for single stack AICS magazines, but it fits in the fanny, and you can do two, um, two of those next to each other. Next up, gonna jump into what it looks like with 556 magazines. So again, let's pull them out. We've got two PMAGs here and two Kiwis with a conversion kit. So um, the PMAGs go in just fine. I've got Gen 2 and Gen 3 here and they both go in um, super easy. Pull out with just enough force. And then PMAG 20s also have a good height to them. There's those guys there. Last uh, but not least, actually I've got two more. Um, we'll move into the metal magazines. So Kiwis need to be broken in a little bit um, with metal 5.56 mags, but the 20 rounders fit in just fine. And there's actually enough to grab. Um, so you can run those without worry. And then the Surefeed, um, the OK Industries, those go in just fine as well. So again, um, if you're looking to run Kydex inserts, and that's really primarily what you're going to do is run magazines on the hybrid fanny pack, it's a great option. Um, it does add some bulk, but really that's the, uh, the only downside. So if you're, if you're running mags primarily, um, it's great to go. If you're going to be running it as, I guess, a fanny pack more so, um, and have the option to run ammo on occasion, um, the lower profile elastic inserts um, are probably your best bet. Thanks. Take it easy, guys.